Hello fans, views and subscribers, and welcome back to another beer review with me, Ruku. Today's beer review is this. Can't wait to try this. This sounds amazingly good. This is Bush Character, or Carter, I think that's pronounced, uh, which means Bush Character. This is a 330 from Belgium, and uh, is 12%. There we go, 12%. Um... Okay, got a little bit of information. So this then is a fil top. Well, this is a filtered, top fermented beer made from malt hops, natural sugars, and water from the brewery's own underground source, uh, and an exclusive house yeast that has been cultivated for eighty years. Doesn't that sound amazing? Um, yeah, that's that's. Um, Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Right. Let's move that in there a minute. Let's have a look at this because I can't wait to try this. So top fermented beer. Beautiful hiss. Camp is, I don't know what that's meant to be. DF. Probably represented as some brewery, I don't know. Smells incredible. Smells orangey, like orange. Look at that. That is super clear. Look at the colour. That's insane. Real clear orange colour. Good white head. Nice and foamy. And here it hissing away. Carbonation is not a problem. The head looks a bit watery. Uh, the body looks a bit watery, I must admit. But having said that, this should be good because of the way that it's made. And uh, let's move that into shot a bit more. And the way that it's been made. So let's, let's crack straight on with this because. I can smell the aromas here, and this this is incredibly good. First thing I'm getting is banana. <sighs> banana. There's, I want to say a sweet smell, maybe like um, sugary, powdery sugary, like icing sugar, something along that line. <sighs> Hints of orange. And a tad of grass. That smells good. Right. I'm not going to fuck about here, so let's do this. <coughs> oh. That's boozy. It's boozy. Um... Boozy. I feel that there's clove in this, like a real good spice, like all spice clove. There's a sweet bitterness, which is nice. Something different. I'm not used to that, so that's, I'll give it a mark for that because it's quite different. Tastes a bit orangey. Right at the finish there, I've got this sweet, oh God, I don't know how to describe that, sweet citrus, it's almost like, no, that's not right, that's, liquish, liquish, it's settled down and I've got liquish, that is unmistakably liquish. That is really weird. So, very boozy forward. Lively carbonation throughout this. Very boozy, lively carbonation. Uh, Flavours of spice, I would say, all spice, something on that line. Nutmeg, even. It's got nice warmth to it. Um, sweet bitterness. Aftertaste is liquish. Uh, and there's also 
again on the aftertaste there's a bit more of that spice coming in which with the licorice surprisingly reminds me of like um i want to say like a, a spiced orange flavor it's really weird it mixes so well it does taste like a spiced orange i guess which is weird because licorice is completely different from spiced orange but to me that's what i'm getting it's just sitting right at the back of the molders in between that's your molders if you imagine your teeth like that that's your sort of jawline here uh, right on the back here is like a as i said that spiced orange and then just towards the front of me is licorice that is really really hard hitting the flavors i say the body of the beer I put it a medium, medium bodied. But my god, it's that spice. That spice, that licorice, that orange, all happening. That is a sipper because it's actually quite boozy. The flavours are boozy, it's just boom. But you want to sip it because the flavours that it gives you are so intense. So intense. It's Boom, 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 all the way through. I'm trying my best not to nick this, but... Yeah, that's as best as I can describe it. Spicy, citrusy, liquish, aromas of banana and stuff like that, so... Fantastic beer, what would I score this out of 10? I will give Bush Kalikia. Um I think I'll give that an eight. Maybe an eight and a half. I'd say about an eight and a half. There's it's because of the spices. If it wasn't for the spices, I'd give it an eight, but that's really nice. Um there it is again. Bush character, twelve percent from Belgium. Fantastic beer. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share my videos. Turn the bell notification icon on and you'll be notified every time I do a new video. And also, don't forget, join me on Instagram as well, at Roku's Beer. See you there.